I got my homie Britty representing the West Coast, California, so L. Dot, A. Dot, Britty, Rap. Money Shaw, Third Republic, World Republic. Chilling with my boy, man. He's talking about the struggle in music and, and how people read a book by his cover every day. And it's our job to prove him wrong. Might never mix it. Mind of a mixed kid. Welcome. Wake up in the morning, feel that house so free. This is shit where you looking at yourself in the mirror, you know? And that's the thing is that a lot of these dudes, the reason why they can stand on their boo-boo ass, half-ass, and I'm saying it, yes, there is a lot of dudes in this industry that are boo-boo and half-ass, and you got a fucking YouTube account, and you got Fruity Loops for the first five minutes, and you recorded one track, and you shot a half-ass music video, and you really believe that that's about to fucking get you to the top of the game? No, 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 my homie, like, for real, like, all these people that you guys are gonna see here are gonna tell you that that is so wrong. Man. It's what they want you to believe, but at the end of the day, this shit takes hard work, man. And it takes a lot of hard work. And facing yourself in the mirror in those moments where you gotta get up and you gotta look yourself in the mirror after 48 hours in the studio and you got shit to handle and you got bills to pay and you got babies to feed and you got all this shit, that's where the difference is, is that you know, there's those old phrases that if you stay ready, you ain't gotta be ready. Yes. You know, the more you sweat in peace, the less you need Or like the reward. definition of luck. Preparation meeting opportunity. Niggas be thinking that shit's popping off for like a nigga in five minutes, but nah, he was prepping for that five minutes his whole life. I get him with the gang of vicious bitters and wicked pizza, yeah, just a bitter, just a little how I kill him. Murder dumb, the man the type of people that I fuck with, they make the music that's about their real life. And yo, if it just so happens that it doesn't sound industry that so be it. If it does, there's nothing against that. This is not something like, we're not trying to push a backpack mentality or, or an industry mentality. Nah. This is just a group of folks that I fuck with personally that's, that's just real people. Going through real things, they're extracting imagery from things that they've either seen, they've been around, or they've experienced themselves, you know? And they're, they're giving you that imagery. And, that, and that's what I believe real music is. I believe that there is some folks in the industry that do that, and I believe that there's some that aren't. And at the end of the day, it's, it's all about to what state does it affect you. Because like my man said, he was out on tour, he was doing his thing, you know, he signed to a major, but at the end of the day, it's like, if you can't personally wake up and feel right. good about what you're doing, you know. Then why are you doing it? Like, it gotta be, if you look at the word purpose, you gotta live on purpose. Like, what is, what is your purpose? That's why I'm in music. I really want to tell niggas that. Like, like I really want to help, help niggas. That's that's my main priority with this music shit. I, I don't live for me, man. I live for, I live for everybody around me. If I'm a blessing, I'm gonna be a blessing. If I can inspire people, my nigga. If I can, like Pac said, man. If I can inspire that one kid to just, just do it. wreck shop. Oh my God, I did, I did what I had to do. So I was, I was vibing it with it, with it like something like this. yourself you carry yourself you have a work ethic and you have you know you stand at the end of the day you stand on your word and your balls and as a man you know on some real shit when it comes down to everyday life shit people can look at you and they can interact with you and they can see that yo I, I can trust this dude just off the sole fact that like he is what he says he is he don't try to be something he's not and every time I kick it with him he keeps it a hundred and that's how that law of attraction works is that those people they feel comfortable to speak your name and stand on your name because they remember like yo I can yeah my yeah I can vouch for my dude you know he's a good that's a good dude right there because the wealthiest thing in this game isn't the money it's mm -hmm. the it's the relationship are you gonna be a, a solid nigga with you know five million in your account <laughs> like for real right. that's the test I know cares that I feel like and I'm not, not even judging I just feel like everybody cares here. But nah, they, they probably would be the, the cats, the, the guys that I surround myself with, they got just as much drive with as their first song. Mm -hmm. Probably 500 song, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But when you find those people and you don't gotta think about it twice and then try to figure it out, that's what music's about for me. Oh, I pulled up to that 7 new flavor is
exactly why we standing here right right Damn. now today is because there was the, those people, those, that person. Those pots that out artist, there, you feel yeah, me? Those pots yeah. and Andre, those people that are willing to put that artistry out of their sleeve and be like, yo. And that's that's one of the reasons why it's because there's artists like that that were never scared of who they are, and that's why I can be me. I honestly believe, and not on some cocky shit, but just on some real shit. Like I believe one million percent that I've worked hard enough and I've been blessed with enough talent that it's gonna happen when it's supposed to happen at the level it's supposed to happen. I'm not gonna sit here and say I'm gonna be fucking a millionaire one day. Hey, I'm shooting to be the best that I can fucking be. I'm shooting to outdo everybody. I don't know if that's the way that my shit's gonna hit. If it does, great. I know I've strived for that level of greatness. If it hits a little bit lower than that, then that's what it was supposed to be. And I'm not gonna fucking question it. You gotta make peace with who you are, you know? Don't try to be somebody you're not. Be you and push you. And the thing is, is that there is always a spot for the you in this. Because there's always somebody else. Don't try to be the him or the that. There, there's inspiration everywhere and you gotta take that and you use that as an artist, but at the end of the day, you still always gotta be you. You gotta be Britty, you gotta be K, you gotta be Zach, you gotta be who you are because in this thing, there's always a space for that original you, but there's no hard. more space for you to be someone else. I'll back up.